Welcome to this new lesson. Okay, on the last lesson we installed our theme already on the WordPress. Now we're gonna install a plugin for that theme to make it work perfectly. You can view your website from here. Visit website. And now we're gonna add this plugin called Companion Plugin. Uh, this plugin will add about us template and header slider to our website, as you can see. This is from the same uh, link we started to get our theme from. We've got full screen slider and about page. About us page, then we're gonna press on download, download, then download files. And here you can get everything from the theme aisle. Well, let's search for companion. If you start typing even compa and we got it. Let's start downloading and it's being downloaded, okay? And we can go back to our dashboard and start installing that. Press on plugins, add new. And here we go. And we're gonna press on upload plugin if we're gonna upload plugin that's being downloaded. And here you can search for plugins. Now we're gonna upload one. Press on that and then choose file and here we go open and install now unpacking package and installing the plugin and plugin installed successfully okay so you got it activating the plugin and here as you see the installed plugins uh, let's go and deactivate all these plugins and don't delete them just keep the companion aisle plugin that we just installed those came with the, with the wordpress by default but we don't need them they're gonna make your website slower some of them are not that much if you need one of them later you can activate it but let's delete this this one for example gives you a lyrics on the wordpress you don't need that okay and it's gonna make your website slower much slower Plugins are meant to make your website perfect and give it the additions you would like to add to your website but if you have extras you don't need them just deactivate them because sometimes you uh, they interact with each other or conflict with each other and give you bugs through your websites or make it like uh, stuck at some point so delete any extras now back to our website now it's uh, it had the other slider added and the about us template added now it's responsive as you can see if you press on customize this is a full screen or desktop view and here's a tablet or ipad view the website being adjusted very well and this is a mobile version looks amazing actually okay here is the pro version if you want to upgrade later and here is the site identity we're going to change the logo and site title let's go for man shop for example man fashion and accessories for tutorial purpose and let's give it man shop and get in get stylish and we can upload the the logo being will be uploaded later we're gonna do the logo later in the end of the course and here as you can see it in the upper left corner and now save and publish and you can check the colors if you want to change the colors of the website here is that head uh, header text color you can change the man shop color if you want to uh, gray any color you want this magenta color you can try the color that suits you or suits your website style or design for me i'm gonna keep it as white for now and let's go to background color feel free guys to change the color and experiment with that this is a gray version and go funk if you'd like go stylish and try different looks for your website this one is magenta blue the uh, cyan maybe i will go for the white myself but like you can go and try different styles that might suit your art direction and your look for the website that's it for our lesson for today that was khalil ibrahim with you hope you enjoyed that lesson and see you next lesson